EFNN, The Tiger, Financial News Network. TFNN, Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this Monday, the 18th of March. We're looking at the Dow up 83, 38,795. Really testing, testing, testing the support level. It's going to be very important in the next couple of days that the uh, Dow holds the 38,300 level if it drops at all. We're looking at the S&P at this particular stage, uh, having a much better rally, a very strong rally, up 43, uh, 51.60. Uh, so far, all the technicals are pretty good. Looking at the QQQ, not four, three of them, yeah. Um, just a nice bounce up 4.95 at 438.84. Watching that nine period moving average getting closer and closer to turning negative, but it hasn't yet. So this is a it's an important week for sure. Each week is important, obviously, but this one is particularly important because this is the time period that we're expecting if it's going to happen at all. These nine period moving averages that have been really holding the market up very nicely. Each each one of the uh, different sectors gets a test. And the IWM, the Russell 2000, at this particular stage is down 62, to 1.76 days young. But yeah, that 9 period moving average is just about turn negative. It hasn't yet. None of them have. We're looking at gold. Um, gold is trying to have a little bit of a bounce here. It's up uh, 0.05, just about unchanged at 2162, holding really well when you consider that it's had uh, five, six sessions of consolidation of the spectacular run to the upside. Um, how it handles the uh, 2140 area support is going to be important, but so far it's doing well. Looking at the dollar, the dollar was running a little bit earlier on. Yep, it's up four ticks at 103.47. And crude oil, um, crude oil is up again, up 65 cents at 81.22. Just very quietly, each week is making higher highs and higher lows. Looking at the bonds, now this is different. This one keeps making lower lows and lower highs. Down 8.30 seconds at 118 and 15.30 seconds. So what the Fed does in the next couple of days when they finally come on stage to talk about the outlook, hmm, it's going to be very important. Don't forget, I'm doing my webinar tomorrow night. We've started to tiptoe into areas we haven't been in uh, for quite some time. Um, there's a, there are a lot of interesting things going on, and I think the next two months are going to see that fruition. And I'll be back for in a, in a moment for my Tiger Technician's Hour. Hope you can stay. Look forward to seeing in a few months.